Good morning, sir. It is 7 a.m. Please wake up. Jarvis, five more minutes, please. Please wake up, sir, or else you will miss your online class. Okay. Jarvis, please play music. Hey guys, welcome back. Multitech here. I know many people after watching Iron Man movies wanted to make Jarvis. But some of them thought it was not easy and some of them thought it was not possible. But what if I tell you it's possible in an easy way using Python. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to make Jarvis using Python. Without me wasting more time, let me just show you what other things Jarvis can do. Okay, so first it can wake you up, like you have seen in the beginning of the video. After you wake up, you might do your homework. But what if you get a question while doing your homework? Jarvis, search photosynthesis. Everyone needs a break after doing our homework. Jarvis, open YouTube. Or just listen to music. Jarvis, play music. Want to message someone without you typing anything? Jarvis, message viewers. Ready. Please subscribe. I hope they received it. Or close tab without you touching the mouse. Jarvis, close tab. Or just shutting down the computer. Jarvis, shut down the computer. Now that you have seen the demo, let's start programming. Oh no, wait, it got shut down. Okay, now it's on. Yeah. So there are some steps to follow before I explain you the program. First, we need to download PyCharm and Python. Basically, PyCharm is a software where we can write and run Python program. You can also use Visual Studios. After you're done downloading, go to the description of this video and click the link below code. After you go to this page, copy the code with Ctrl C command. And then open PyCharm. Remove the code and paste the code which you just copied with Ctrl V command. After doing that, we need to download some libraries by copying the statement, opening terminal, pasting the statement into terminal and clicking enter. First, we need to download the PYTT SX3 library, which is for our audio. Then we need to download the speech recognition library for our computer to listen to us. Then we need to download the PYWatKit library for closing tab, shutting down the computer or messaging someone. Then the last thing we need to download is Pi Audio. But for some reason there is some error when I'm downloading Pi Audio using pip. I have a solution for it. First we need to download pipwin library using pip and then download pi audio using pipwin. After downloading these libraries, let's see the code. Okay, so first I made a variable called engine which is pyttsx3 init sapify which is a male voice. 
Then I made a function called speak using the variable we just made. Then I made a function called take command for our computer to understand us. In which first I made a variable called r which is equals to sr.recognizer and with our microphone as source I set to print listen which is basically to indicate us that our computer is listening to us. Then I gave a pause threshold for one second which means if there is nothing heard by the computer after one second do the next step which is recognizing part. In this part I said try print recognizing and if it recognized something print what it recognized. But if it does not recognize what we just said print can't hear you and return none. After writing those two functions, we will write our main program. Here it is written if name is equals to main, which means if we run this program, run the code below this. Then I said when we run this program, check if the current time is 7 am. If it is equals to or greater than 7 am, open this file and then speak this sentence. Make sure you write the line which you want Jarvis to say between these two quotation marks. Then if that's true, take command. If there is open YouTube in command, which means if I say open YouTube, open the web browser and go to this URL. You can go to any website by changing the URL like I have done here. I have changed the URL to Google, Stack Overflow, Python, etc. Then I said if play music is in command, open this file. You need to give the path where the file is in your computer. If it is a mp3 file, you need to write the name of the file .mp3 or else it will not work. And this is the command for our Jarvis to say the time. Now let's move on to the search command. In which I said if search is in command, speak let's perform google search. Take command, if command is not equal to none, search what I said. Here I gave a if command because whenever it was not recognizing what I said, it was searching none. But I didn't want that. That is the reason why I gave a if command here. Then this is the command for closing the tab using pywatkit. Then I said if message is in command, speak ready and take command. And if command is not equal to none, send message on this number. And the message we need to send is what we just said. This is the code for shutting down our computer. In this I set the time limit to 2 seconds. This is the code to stop your program if you feel to stop the program. Now you can run the program and see if there is any error. Hello sir. Please tell me how may I help you. Open Python. Close tab. Stop. Shutting down. If you get some errors, please feel free to comment down below. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Please like the video, share and subscribe. And also comment down below what should I make next. That's all for today. Bye.